It's the big day! I'm so excited! What is up guys? Welcome back to another funky fresh video from yours truly. So this just might be... No, this is literally my most exciting best video ever. So... Recently, I oh, got my can. I'm like, I'm not using my tripod right now because I'm too lazy to take it out of my bag. So I'm just using my arm because I know this is going to be like a short little intro. So I am about to drive to Miami from where I am, which is like a four hour drive. And I've never driven this far. And I'm super nervous. And I know my family's super nervous. But I'm going to the Good American Casting with IMG Models. This is probably like the biggest moment of my life, but I've just, I've never felt so ready. I have a playlist that's gonna keep me going the whole way there. It's five hours long with just nothing but upbeat songs and I'm ready to do this. So you're gonna vlog with me and see how it goes. And I'm planning on getting there like four hours early. So I'm hoping the line's not already started by then, but it's first come first serve and I am not leaving till I get casted there. And that is a promise. So. I will see you in Miami. Bye. Oh my God. I'm so excited. I could, I like literally got like two hours of sleep last night and I still feel great. Let's go. I can't get you out of my mind. So I am now, I actually have no idea where I am. I know I'm right before Alligator Alley, which if you're not from Florida or you just don't know what it is, it's pretty much like crossing Florida, but there's like no gas stations no nothing like if your car breaks down you're screwed um so i just stopped to get gas and i got breakfast i got me some uh <laughs> mcdonald's hash browns because a i'm picky eater and b i would sell my soul to those hash browns so understandably i got some for breakfast um, i'm hoping i don't have to use the bathroom i'm trying not to drink a lot because boy i'm not getting out to pee with the gators so we're just gonna hope and pray that that doesn't happen uh, the next time i see you i will probably be in miami hopefully so see you then Bye bye i'm here i am in miami holy freaking god like let me just tell you how oh god sorry if it's shaking like my tripod broke so i'm I'm, try, I'm working here let me just tell you how this drive went so like i said like the last time you saw me i was stopped right before alligator alley and then i'm about like 20 miles in or no i'm like i had 20 miles left until i got to like civilization and a trooper turns his lights on i was going 10 over but like on the if like if you know like in florida on the interstate like going five to ten over is normal but and he was in my lane so i switched lanes and then he switched the other lane turns out he was pulling someone else over literally i had like an ass attack i was so scared i like after like when he pulled the other person over i was like Whoa! like i knew i wasn't doing anything illegal but you know when you see a police car and you're like what did i do you think of every wrong doing you've done that's what happened but i didn't i'm here not a lot of people here that's good i'm really scared there's gonna be a line i need to you know it's first come first serve so i need to get in so i'm gonna go in now i haven't finished my makeup i only did a little bit because i didn't want to like ruin it on the way here so i'm gonna go inside see how it's looking i don't even know if the mall is open yet it is like 10 o'clock right now so i'm gonna go inside explore and i'm gonna bring my makeup bag and everything so i can do my makeup in there when you look good from the down view <laughs> oh god this mall is like literally okay i should probably put it like this because it's gonna be really hard to edit this mall is literally so pretty and there's so many people and they're all staring at me i love it i'm so excited but i'm even more excited to see if this bathroom will be open if it's not i need to find a bucket okay brd so there was a bathroom I am good. Um, this mall is like made for rich people. Let me let me just give you a little montage. Can I take you there? Take you there? Like it was the first time, do you remember? Can I take you there? Back to the small called me poor as soon as I walked in, and I'm okay with it. We felt like this was forever. Can I take you there? There's a freaking Ferrari store. I can't say. <laughs> okay, so in summary, this mall is freaking awesome. I want to live here. Um, sorry again if it's shaking. I didn't bring my tripod because I didn't know if it would be open or not. Turns out it was. 
So I'm not sure if I should do my makeup in there, you know, and get ready, or if I should just wait till it opens, because technically casting is until three. I think I may just like chill in my car and then wait to the casting, like, or like till it opens. I just don't want people to come in and I not be ready, you know, so I don't really know what to do, but I brought a book and I have you guys. So I'm gonna be entertained. So let's do this thing. Okay, so I know this angle is weird, but it's the only thing that's holding my phone, so just deal with it. So I'm gonna put my Mickey on up in here because I like, I have my eye on the door and I don't want it to get too busy. Like I don't wanna go do my makeup and then just like the entire world be here. So I'm gonna just do my makeup here. So I don't actually remember what I said this morning in the vlog cause I was just, the crack energy that I had from waking up and preparing for like the four hour drive was a lot. So let me just explain further in depth what's happening. So there is a brand called Good American. If you don't know the brand, Khloe Kardashian, I'm sure you know her. They're pretty much having a casting. It's been like worldwide. They went to like England, Canada, and like a whole bunch of big cities in America. It's a first come first serve basis. So pretty much big scouts are gonna be there and then reps from Good American and um, pretty much IMG models. If I haven't stressed enough in my past videos, they're my dream and only agency I want to be a part of. So the fact that they're coming to Miami was huge. They told me it was, I found out Friday, then they're like, oh, it's this Sunday, come this Sunday if you want to get like scouted and like do the scouting thing. And I was like, I am honestly so surprised my mom said yes to this, like, cause I know how stressful it is to let your kid drive to like one of the most dangerous cities in America. So honestly, I'm going to keep shouting out my mom. I love you. This is the best thing you probably could have ever let me do. And you're the best mom in the world. That's on God. So I am now, I woke up at like six in the morning and now I'm waiting. I was hoping it would be open at 10, which is when now I got here at 10. And then the reason why I got here so early, I should probably also explain, I said before it's first come first serve. The IMG Models is the biggest modeling agency in the world. And Good American is a very big, notorious, amazing brand about like self-worth, self-love, and they represent all body types. So literally, them, Chroma, and Airy are like my dream brands. I love them so much. But yeah, so that's why this is like probably the biggest deal of my lifetime of like anything I've ever done in my life. This is a humongous deal and for once in my life I just feel ready. Like when I was at the IMG fashion camp, I was not ready to become a model. I mean I was better than when I started freshman year and I was like being a model is taking pictures and looking pretty woo. But even then I just wasn't in a good place and I wasn't ready to become a model. So I am so glad that like now I feel so ready. I'm ready to make change and this is like I'm literally so excited. This is the most excited I've been since birth. I think I finished my makeup because I don't really want to do anything else. I just want it to look natural. My eyes are looking like really good right now. Like, I like them. So, um, it's a little empty. My friends currently think I'm crazy right now, but I drove four hours to get here, so I'm glad I'm here first. So now I get to sit here for three hours. I got my, you know, auntie and a good little book. So I'll vlog midway through as it gets closer. Hopefully more people come so I can like talk to them. I feel like the people here think I'm a mix of crazy and cute, I've heard. So, you know, good things for both, but I will see you when it gets closer. Hello. So I am back at the hotel room. What did I just do to my hair? Um, better. I am, oh yeah, so I didn't mention this. I was not planning on staying overnight in Miami, um, but they did mention that they're doing callbacks tomorrow and they'll email us so to stay local. So to prevent me from driving all the way home, I decided to stay here. So I'm in my hotel room now, about to go get some food and then just chill for the night. Um, that was literally probably the coolest thing I've ever been to in my life. Um, it started off kind of weird because I got there like three hours early and nobody was there. But luckily some girls came and they were literally the sweetest girls I've ever met. And it was really cool to like see their stories and how they traveled everywhere and all the things they've done. Like I 
know more than ever that this is what I want to do. So I'm crossing my fingers that I get an email tonight from Good American. It was really cool and amazing. I just like, I don't really have words for it. Like I feel like I'm just not saying the right stuff, like real words. It's just because it was such like an amazing experience. But I gotta go get my food and my car is ready downstairs. So goodbye for now. Okay, so the last check-in that I did was kind of weird because I didn't know I was staying in a hotel. It was all really last minute and then the hotel gave me trouble because I'm not 21. So it was stressful, but I'm here now. I feel better. I got me some food. I got some breakfast for tomorrow. Um, I think I'm going to wake up early and look at the beach because I'm on Miami Beach, so I might as well. And I've just calmed down a little bit. Today's just been really chaotic and crazy. But a really good day and i'm really liking the lifestyle so this is it for tonight i think i'm going to continue vlogging while i'm here but this will be the last one for tonight because i'm going to dine and watch tv and relax because it's much needed so i will see you tomorrow morning goodbye look at this pizza though by the way Well, this is a good angle. Ugh. I literally need to get a new tripod. This is like not working. So it is my last day here. I'm still in Miami, but I'm on the beach. Look at Dia. So nice. So nice. But yes, I have not gotten any response from Good American. There's just some like an email or something. Um, didn't get any response. So kind of disappointed about that these people like literally look at all the construction that's going on so i'm probably gonna head home soon i'm gonna wait till 10 because that's when they said they'll officially like send people in and everything um but all in all this was like a freaking good experience i had like three near-death experiences from the trooper car chasing me um almost not getting into the hotel and i have no idea how to check out so that'll be interesting but this was like a really cool experience um i learned a I definitely know I want to do this like forever. I love traveling, meeting these girls, castings. It was like a really awesome experience. Um, being by myself was really like really awesome. This was like so much fun. And I don't know, I feel a little more sure about myself, which I know sounds weird because I didn't get the casting, but I feel like now more than ever, I know this is like what I want to do. So maybe this was, you know, I feel like, you know, it sounds corny, but everything happens for a reason. This trip happened for a reason, so I'm hoping somewhere near in the future I'm gonna figure out why. I think. I think this was good for me. So, to every girl that I did meet, if you're watching this video, um, it was really nice to meet you guys. I hope you guys got it, and if you didn't, don't quit here. This is just the beginning. So, uh, yes, wish me luck that checking out doesn't go wrong, because this is my first time ever like checking into a hotel, so kind of difficult for me. Okay, yeah, that's it for me. Um, after that, I'm probably gonna drive home, which is four hours. Can't wait for that drive. Um, but yes, I am like, it's weird because like this trip didn't turn out how I wanted it to. And like yesterday, I was like high key depressed over it, if you couldn't tell by like my weird mood, but I'm in like such a good mood now because like, I don't know, this experience is like so awesome. I'm really starting to like, I've just been so unsure of what I want to do in the future. And now that I like am seeing stuff that I actually like, like I'm not used to actually liking, you know, that sounds like really like depressing and dark, but like now that I found something I really love, I'm just excited and I really want to pursue it. So thank you for coming along this chaotic journey. I actually really like making vlogs. I feel like I should do more because they're just easier for me to edit and I feel like it just has more content. But yes, that is the end of this vlog. If you like this video, make sure to subscribe and share with everybody you know, because maybe someone else wants to go to Miami on a whim. Do it, literally do it. It was like, the, this is probably the coolest thing I've ever done in my life. And also make sure you like it, because mama needs some money so I can do more stuff like this. I'm just kidding.
but I'm also not kidding. I got tuition to pay. Um, and then Good American, thank you so much for this experience. Same with you, IMG models. Even though I didn't get it, expect to see my face more because I'm still gonna hashtag till the day I die. So I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in two Fridays with another funky fresh video from your favorite friends. Oh my gosh, this lighting. I need to take some selfies. The sun came out. Like, look at this. It's so pretty. But not as pretty as me. Okay, goodbye.